Hi, I'm Willie Mullins with Mullins Racing. Out of Fredericksburg, Virginia. Um, we're here at the shop today um, answering a few of Dominion Raceways questions. Um, here at Bugsy's Auto and Mullins Racing, we take care of ARCA, REMAX cars, um, SCCA, road race cars, and a ver wide variety of short track and other cars. Um, I got involved in racing when I was a young kid. My dad has always drag raced. Um, I started drag racing myself when I was a little kid in the junior dragster program. Um, after that, I decided to change and go from something else, uh, and I wanted to do something different. Our family's always raced, so I decided to get into stock car racing, and that brought me into road racing. So we bought our first stock car from Joe Falk. Um, once we got started there, we started SCCA racing, and that's taken us up and down the whole entire East Coast, and that's allowed us to build a, our business around stock cars and road racing. Um, this first, uh, this year in 2015, we went to Daytona uh, and ran the ARCA Series 200 at the Daytona International Speedway, um, where we were on a good finish and then unfortunately broke an oil line and when we did that it got us some TV time in the unfortunate way a big fireball so to the oval track experience wasn't the way we wanted to go but it definitely is a, a stepping stone to the future. Uh, in 2015 we're starting our road race season off at some point in West Virginia um, with the car behind me that's a uh, purpose-built road course car um, it has a uh, ECR engine in it um, from Childress uh, SB2 that um, has, makes 850 horsepower. Um, this car has been in our stable for about seven years now. We've built it brand new. Um, it's getting a little, little old, a little worn out, but this car has been a good car. Um, we're actually going to put a different driver in it this weekend. Uh, JJ Pax is going to drive this car. He also drove the car at Daytona. Hopefully he'll have a little bit better finish at some point this weekend than Daytona, but uh, we'll see how the weekend goes, and we're going to continue to work hard for the future and, and see where it goes. Um, with the Dominion Raceway coming to Fredericksburg, Virginia, we've been supportive since day one. We were at all the hearings, at all the meetings, uh, everything along with Mr. Britt. Uh, Mr. Britt has stopped by the shop to see us numerous occasions to see how things are going. We're uh, very excited and very supportive of Mr. Britt's uh, opportunity to give us a track in our, our backyard. Um, it's going to help us tremendously by just being able to run down the street and test. Um, you know, think about this is we'll be able to load up, be at the track in under a half an hour, unload and be on the track. The customers can be in their bed after they're done testing that night, go back home, you know, and then we, if we need to test another day, it's not losing days of travel. We're going to be able to do this right in our backyard. So this has been a big benefit to Mr. to us here at Mullins Racing. Uh, Mr. Britt putting all this effort forward to, to make this track uh, come to Fredericksburg. A lot of work, a lot of work ahead. But we're definitely very supportive of him and, and hope that we can be down there with him for the, the grand opening. Mullins Racing, we're, we're planning for the future here. Um, with the big step into the ARCA Series this year at Daytona, we're looking to run this year some short track races, uh, possibly Winchester or Indiana or something like that, or DeCoin even on the dirt. Um, once we go there, we're looking to go back to Daytona in 2016 uh, with our circle track program and try to get the finish we wanted. We're going to step up to the new motor program in 2016. Uh, we have some sponsors that are giving us a help with Crawford Sprinkler Systems. Um, they're giving us a, a, a good chance to, to make the race again next year. Uh, Bugsy's Auto, you know, being here to help us with just day-to-day -day maintenance on all these cars. We appreciate that and all the friends and family that help us uh, work and maintain these cars. Uh, also on the 2015 calendar is all of our road racing that we're planning on doing at Summit Point and VIR. Um, we have Bob Sanford and Zenith Aviation coming back with us in 2015. Um, it's been a couple years since he's raced with us, but he's got a, a better car. He's coming back, and we have uh, J.J. Pack racing with us. Um, Rob Veshi is coming back in a car, so we have a lot going on, a lot of drivers wanting to get in cars. 
We also have Robert Corzen and his T1 Mustang that's part of our team. So they keep us busy here at Mullins Racing that uh, we can work day, every day on race cars and we enjoy it. And without those guys' support, we wouldn't have anything to do. We'd have to have a regular job. So we appreciate everybody and what they do for us.